Alrighty guys, welcome back to another video here on the channel. As you guys know, the new Minecraft version snapshots have been released. We're in 19W34A? Nin what is it? 19W34A. I'm right. I'm right. It's good. It's good. So welcome your faces back to another Top 5 Seed video. Ladies and gentlemen, today we're in the B update. For the B update is what I'm going to call this. I don't know I don't know how I'm titling this video, but ladies and gentlemen, this will be top five seeds where you get to see bumblebees right off of spawn in every single seed. You are going to have a beehive and you're going to have a, uh, a set of bees right away, right off of spawn. So if you guys are new to my channel, my name is Minnie the Gaming, but you guys can call me Justin. Uh, if you guys are actually new to my channel, consider hitting the subscribe button because I appreciate it more than you guys could literally ever believe. It is truly amazing. And if you guys enjoyed the video, hit the like button. Now, we are in 19W34A, and we are on the Java edition, and all the seeds will be displayed on your screen, and they're in the description. So, without further ado, let's get to seed number one. Now, I'm still learning about these bees, about these buzzy little bees, but I did know that they spawn in a flower biome, so I started doing some research and found five of them with beehives right- Look at these things, okay? You get a beehive right here, and you have bees. You got little tiny bees buzzing around, and you get them right off of spawn. Did you see that one over there? There's one way over there. So these guys are actually going to pollinate the flowers, which is so cool. I actually love that they're adding more aerial things to Minecraft instead of just phantoms. We've never really had anything other than bats and parrots to fly. And these things are absolutely amazing. I love Minecraft for adding these. Look at the little beehives. Oh, they're so cool. I absolutely love them. So there you go. You spawn right over here. Right here, right where we were when I did the intro. And you have a beehive with bees right off the bat. You get to see the buzzy little buggers. Now this next seed, ladies and gentlemen, I find actually really unique. As you can see, you got the buzzy little bees. They're all over the place. They're so freaking cool. But where can you find these buzzy little bees hives? Well, in that tree, perhaps? In that beautiful little tree right there? You get the buzzy little guys right off of spawn again, directly behind you. You basically spawn into them. Not only is there a beehive there, there's also one at the end of this tree line. You get two. You get two right away. Right away. There's probably more. I don't know. There's one over there, too. You get three right away. Man, I did not look at this seed well enough. You get three right off the bat, and I bet you there's one up here. These new bees are so cool. They're so plentiful. Oh, that's so sweet. Like I said, I haven't even had a chance to play with them yet, and I'm so, so, so excited to be able to play with them. Oh, there they are. And one over there, too. Oh, you guys are in for a treat for this video. Now this next seed, ladies and gentlemen, I'm calling Busy Bee Island, and I think it earned its name. Busy Bee Island has a beehive on a survival island. Oh my god, it has everything you could ever ask for. It has horses, it has a shipwreck, and it has the cute new bees. I couldn't be more excited. I couldn't be more excited about this. It got cute little bees. You got cute little bees. I think that is the most important thing of this video, is you got the cute... Little bees. This guy's kind of confused. You're going to want to get some flowers. Get some flowers so these guys are happy and make yourself a cool little bee sanctuary. Nice and trapped on this island. Well, not trapped. Sanctuaries aren't trapped. Nice and secluded. Secluded is the word we're going to use. On this beautiful island with a shipwreck. Remember when that was the big thing? It was like shipwreck and ocean ruins. Absolutely phenomenal. Now it's like a freaking bee. <laughs> Look at the bees! <laughs> oh, I absolutely love them. I can't believe this. It's so freaking cool. Alrighty, guys. Wait, am I, am I, my, my, this snapshot isn't agreeing with OBS, but this next seed, ladies and gentlemen, I find a little peculiar. I find it a little strange because bees, freaking bees, but look at the, look at the biomes, okay? We need to acknowledge something other than bees in this freaking seed. I am actually, like, aiming over here, because I thought I saw another beehive, but it didn't. I don't think it did. There might be one over there. Go check. But you have a desert village <laughs> and a savannah village right beside each other. Well, I guess this might actually be just one village. 
So you get a village right off of spawn, but you get bees. So which one's more important to you at this point in time? Is it the village or is it the bees? Oh man, I think it's the bees. <laughs> Right behind your spawn point is a beautiful, beautiful flower village. Now, you guys may recognize this seed from literally yesterday's video because this seed was in yesterday's video. This is the exact same seed, but it just so happened to have your buzzy little buggers spawning all around you this time. The new update has actually added three of them. Do you see that over there? There's one over there. There's two over there. There's two over there. There's two right there. Two right there. Bam, 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 bam. I unbelievable, unfreaking believable. You get freaking four of them right off the bat. Alrighty, guys. This next seed actually does spawn you directly inside of a village. You spawn right inside of a village. Now I don't know if it's just me, or if it's this new update. You good? Are you okay? Are you okay? I don't think they're okay that doesn't look good but if we wander to the edge of this village we're gonna wander down this dirt path right here to this nice little area this nice little shop area town center bam beehive beehive right at the edge of your town looking phenomenal being a beehive look at it all oh, these things are so cool is that an actual known bug though these guys don't have heads do I have a resource pack on nope okay so, is this a known bug? Hey, you shut the door on me. That's not cool. I don't know what your facial expression is right now, you freaky little turd. Oh my god, but you get a beehive right off of spawn, and you get a bunch of broken villagers, which I might wait to update my single player world to the new snapshot. But, yeah. Anyway, guys, that's going to do it for me here on this episode of the Top 5 Seed Series. Hopefully you guys did enjoy, and hopefully you guys get to feature... I get... I, that's not the word I wanted to say. Hopefully you guys get to experience the new bee feature up close and personal, and if you use any of these seeds, let me know in the comments below. If you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to hit the subscribe button. I like to get a little more sentimental at the end of my videos, so thank you guys so much for the support here on the channel. You guys have absolutely been killing it, and hopefully I can be on top of these top five seed videos whenever there's new features added in the game, and I can get them to you guys as quick as possible. So should be, heard, be sure to hit the subscribe button, because I'm hopefully going to be the first one on this. I would love to be the first one on this. I might not be because it's not my full-time job, but if I ever do YouTube full-time, I promise you I will be the first person on this. But anyway, guys, that's going to do it for me. Honestly, thank you guys for the support. You guys have been killing the channel, and I cannot, cannot thank you guys more. I've never dreamed of being at this position, and you guys are making it possible. So thank you guys, and I will see you guys in the next episode.